Hey guys, it's Kat Freeman from Victory Fight, and today I'm joined with Sarah Casey. Sarah's fighting on Victory in three weeks. How are you feeling? Good. Good. Good, good. Very good. So you're fighting Elise Watson, um, and it is your debut fight, I believe. It is. It is. Very exciting. Uh, so how is your fight camp going so far? Uh, as far as I know, it's going all well. Good, good. <laughs> it's my first time, so I, I don't really know. I, like, I'm putting everything into it, juggling good. kids, juggling life, and camp. I love it, though. Oh, good. Yeah. Um, so you're feeling fit and healthy, um, ready to enter the cage in three weeks. Um, do you, would you say you had a fight style? Um like, what's your background? No, I, just, I just, from the bouts that I've had, I just get in there and get the job done, really. Awesome. Like, you know, they've only been little things up until now. So I'm yeah, just like, like to test my ability. That's what I, I want to know where I am against yeah, the girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so um, the gyms you're training at at the moment, or the gym you're training at, um, are there many other female fighters there? Or because obviously, it's, yeah, it's, it's normally the case. Like it, this sport is just sort of overcrowded with men. Um, yeah. And, yeah. And sometimes it can be hard as a female fighter, you know, even just to find training partners. Um, so how are you finding that? Have you found any difficulties, kind of like being the only girl? um the only difficulty really is like one of our guys is six foot six like I'm hoping I won't go against a woman that high (laughs) you know know? um the only way to do that's a superman punch um but yeah no like I I love my guys and you know I love the fact that I'm doing it with guys because come on yeah they go (laughs) hard you know they go hard and I think yeah yeah like to, I'm, I'm the class clown. They like to probably put me in my place, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I oh know, it's good. Yeah, it's good to have a good team helping you uh, with your fight camp, so that's cool. Um, what else was I going to say? Have you got a message for your opponent at all? Um, no, I, I know she's a lovely person. The thing is, is Kinshira was the first place I learned a love for Muay Thai. Oh, amazing. Um, so, like, I have nothing but respect for all of you girls. So I like I have no fight talk. I'm just saying let's go to the ring, spring it. Let's yeah, do this. I love it. You yeah, know, really teach me yeah. what a female can do, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but um no, that's just a nah. I, I I'm just ready. I'm ready to to see my ability. I'm here to test me. Yeah, yeah, no, it sounds good. I can't wait to see you in the cage. Yeah, it'll be exciting. So I'm looking forward to it. Um do you have a message for your fans? Are you bringing some fans along with you to Brighton to watch Victory? Uh, yeah, I'm going to obviously have my supporters there. I want to thank them for actually putting up with me, having no time for them at the moment. Um, yeah. I want to thank the kids because I'm sharing them, like, you know, sharing time with them and, and Muay Thai and they're having to come and sit and watch me training at stupid, like, hours. And, yeah. And oh. my, coach, my coach and all the lads down at the gym. Oh, good. So my crew, my crew. Your crew, love it. Um, okay, well, it's been really good to speak to you. Good luck with the rest of your Thank fight you. And I will see you November the 2nd, Victory Fight. Yes. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yay. Bye.